Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm back with another video. So today, you guys, I decided to do another affordable hairstyle for you guys. Like if you're still in lockdown, very affordable, um, quick hairstyle for you guys. So I decided to try the trending um, braids that I've seen on Instagram and, you know, all over YouTube as well. So I decided to try them, give them a try on myself, you guys. And I really hope you guys will stay tuned and enjoy this video. And if you're watching this video and you haven't yet subscribed, please do click the subscribe button and, and also make sure you um, leave a thumbs up and uh, turn your notification button so that you'll be notified when I upload videos okay so I'm um, right now I've um, pre-separated my hair off camera because it can be very difficult because I have to use like two mirrors to uh, separate my parts uh, my parts are not that defined uh, they are not that straight they are not that clean um but if you do have someone who can help you do your parts i would rather you get someone to help you do your parts because it's not easy okay it's not easy especially i'm getting older it's it's kind of all over the place it's kind of difficult and i just get tired so if you don't mind doing your own hair you can definitely follow this um tutorial i'm not a professional i do my hair myself self-taught together i have um eight uh braids or eight parts so i'm gonna do like eight braids i'm just gonna turn around so you guys see what the back looks like at the moment okay so this is the braid that i'm going to be using I'm gonna go ahead and start braiding my hair you guys i'm gonna start with this braid one of these braids at the front and then i will definitely show you what i'll be doing i'm gonna do some feeding braids so i can make my braids look nice and thicker I'm going to be using uh, my Mary's base wax just to define my parts a little bit more. You can use gel if you prefer, but I'm just going to use my Mary's base wax. Yeah, so I did one of the braids thinking that I'm recording when I wasn't recording like do forgive me guys I'm just gonna go ahead and show you guys exactly how I do these braids These are not that thick and heavy because I don't have too much hair on my hair anyway And when it comes to my hairline you guys, I really don't want to make it tight and it, that's why you can see um, It's it's not like what you'd expect to see because i do have thin edges so i do have to do what works for me and i don't have to grab all my edges so i can have a neater braid because i don't want to end up with no edges at all like literally so yeah you need to work with what you've got if you've got thicker hairline you guys braid your hair or your braids um coming towards your face or somewhere like right here uh but for me I just I just can't deal it's impossible for me to do that kind of hairstyle I, I feel that the braids you guys as you can see these braids are feathered and um, I'm feeding in like five braids um, so the first braid is a bit thinner and the rest of them are like the same thickness I just hope I'm gonna <laughs> be able to do the same thickness all over like I always tell you guys if your hair is falsely hair like mine you need to stretch your hair first before you achieve these braids otherwise your natural hair will be popping out of the braids so just make sure you bear that in mind always always pre-stretch your hair um i leave mine in twists or cornrows or you know that's how i stretch my hair anyway usually they'll be in big chunky twists and then i just um take them down and just um detangle my hair that's basically what i usually do so i would recommend if you want to achieve some neater braids make sure you stretch your braids your hair first
So I'm just using um, some Blue Magic uh, castor oil just to smooth out my hair in the braids because you don't want your natural hair to be sticking out so you want everything to blend together beautifully. So you guys you need to make sure that you braid all the way to the end so that your braids go um, straight and flat if you don't do that if your braids end somewhere here you're gonna have uh, braids sticking out remember you have to do um, the thickness that you want the thickness that you can actually manage sometimes if I do like thick thick cornrows they become a big mess so just do what you can manage to braid you know what I'm saying <laughs> like otherwise it will be a disaster
I'm still using the same one packet but cut in half so I don't want them too long um, so I'm just cutting them in half and just braiding so i am left with um enough hair for um this braid i thought i was gonna use two um packets but thank god i'm just gonna use one packet which is super cool i haven't touched this packet this is uh, a brand new packet i haven't used so managed to get away with only one packet so if you want them to be thicker you might have to use a little bit more hair but like i said expression braids have more hair and the hair is nice and easy to work with so um if you want to try it out you can actually go ahead and just use one packet hot water to seal your braids they look absolutely tidier you can also use some rubber bands to secure your braid but i actually prefer dipping them in hot water so um i really love these braids you guys they are not that long like i said i'll show you guys so this is how long they are i didn't want mine to be too long if you like yours to be extra long you need to use like almost like the whole braid of the expression Body smoking like a cigarette. Oh, oh. ah, baby, I can smoke it. Hey, ah, ah. Say now you, I want to see when I wake up in the morning. Ah, say now you, I want to feel anywhere that I be going. So this is the finished look you guys i really hope you guys did find this video useful and don't forget to thumbs up this video you guys also comment share, subscribe i'll see you guys in my next video bye for now